Hey, this is Paul from Wondershare Mobile Trans, and today's video is something actually that is quite relaxed, but there is a problem with up to 2.9 billion users. So I imagine that you might be one of these people that are affected by what we're gonna talk about in today's video. This video is all about how you can save those Facebook Messenger chats. So if you wanna export them, hopefully we can tell you how to do that. So why not go and grab that cup of coffee, sit back and relax, and hopefully by the end of this video, you'll have learned something brand new. And if you're new around here to Mobile Trans, then why not go and have a look at some of our other videos as well, where we give you some tips and tricks on some other problems that are fairly similar. And if you enjoy a video that you like, or you enjoy this one, why not subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any of the content that we do in the future hit that notification bell and drop the video a like as well. But before we give you all of those tips on today's video, let me remind you of the lifestyle of a Facebook addict. So the chances are, I'd say 99% chance is that if you've seen this video today, that you have been to Facebook and own a Facebook account at some point in your life. And here's something that's actually really interesting that from a report done this year in 2021, it showed that there was 1.8 billion active daily users on Facebook, which is genuinely insane. In fact, slowly into 2014, Facebook split off the messaging feature from their program. Users were then required to send and receive messages from a different but integrative platform, quite common in the tech ecosystem, actually. The sole objective was to encourage users to send and receive messages off the platform. And it's been working because Facebook is set to claim about 1.38 million users of the Messenger app. Okay, let's just tone down that historical Facebook update for a second, shall we? And let's explore what it is like now we are talking about Messenger. The first question is, have you ever thought for any reason that you might wanna save your Facebook Messenger chats and maybe even print them out? And to be honest, there's several reasons that you might wanna do this. So some of the reasons might be that you could be having some sort of argument or dispute, which you need to then print out these Facebook Messengers for proof to help you win something that you might need to win. It could be that a party has a dispute to settle with another the party based on business disagreements, abuse, social proof, and there's loads of other different reasons. In this video, I will show you ways that you can then save and potentially print out these conversations, which will save you loads of time having to go through the Google and internet and having to search all of this stuff. So stick with this video. And the first method is to use and export all of these chats actually using Facebook itself. This is supposed to be one of those methods that every Facebook user knows. And if you're an average Facebook user, you might not know this. If you're a business and you need to save these messages for client disputes or anything like that, then this is something that might already be common knowledge. But to the average Facebook user, it can be a little bit daunting in how you can go about to save and export those chats from Messenger. So let's start nice and easy. And the first thing you need to do is just go and open that Facebook app on your phone. Click the menu icon close to the bottom of your screen. And then right at the bottom of that menu, you will see settings and privacy. Here is where you expand that section and tap settings on the list. You should be seeing that right on the account settings dashboard. Scroll down to your Facebook information setting and tap download your information. As you get to the next screen, then just tap that deselect all to remove the checkmark options or information you don't want to save. Scroll down to messages and tap the radio button to the right to place a checkmark. When you then scroll down, you can adjust certain things like date range, media quality options, and format. Here, I just recommend that you leave it in its default so you can have an HTML data form with high quality. Then here, just tap that create file option and then jump to your email box to receive Facebook's message to inform you that they are aware of your request. Depending on how much data that you have to save, after a while, Facebook will then tell you that that file is ready to download. And then what you need to do here is log into your Facebook homepage by following the URL facebook.com. And then what you'll then have to do is click on the drop down arrow in the top right corner of the screen to access the settings menu again. As the general account settings is displayed, click on your Facebook information again. And then this is where you click on available copies to see the information that you have requested to be downloaded. Here you click download and your file should just download straight to your computer and it will be in a zip format so you will need to extract it to a different folder. When you open it, you will see a messages file and an index file. When you open that index file, it will take you to your default browser on your information interface. Click your messages to see messages of everyone you've had conversations with on Facebook within that pre-selected timeframe. 
Click on the conversation thread you want to open. A thread of all your conversations in that selected time frame will appear, and then you can print it or save it as a PDF. Now let's talk about the second method in the video, and that's to use something called Decipher Messenger Export. This is one of those methods that is actually really easy and really simple to do. And it is a piece of software that you will download to your desktop so you can save those files right to your computer. Let's go and have a quick run through of the process on how you can use that Decipher Messenger Export app to go and get all of the messengers that you want. Launch the Decipher Messenger Export via your computer, and then you will see a login prompt on your screen. Manually select the Facebook contact that you want to save and print. Select Save. Open the PDF that was downloaded to print your messages. Then just open the PDF that was downloaded to print those messages that you have saved. There's some uniquenesses to using this Decipher Messenger export. And the first thing is that these files are downloaded straight to your computer, so they are private and they are safe. The next thing is that it actually comes with some timestamps and some bubbles when you download those messages. And the third thing is that you can run this either on PC or Mac. There are loads of different ways that you can download Facebook Messenger chats, but hopefully this video has made it a lot easier because I've given you easy and simple ways to download and save and potentially print those chats. But if you have any questions, then why not put them in the comments below because I will get back to you and help you out the best that we can. And hopefully you have enjoyed this video. Even if you're not a Facebook user yourself, maybe one of your friends is and you can give them this video that might be able to help them out. If you did enjoy the video though, why not subscribe to the channel and hit that bell notification, which then means you don't miss any of the videos that we put up on the channel here on Mobile Trans. And why not drop a like on the video as well? And if you do all of that, I will see you in the next video.